Space Coconut. So it took us an hour to try and get this set up. We couldn't get rid of the glare. So the foils are going to have glare. That's the Mana Confluence. That's the one that we got as box promo, right? Mm -hmm. And then today they gave us the Baron Sanger Sangue. And we weren't part of the draft or anything, but they gave it to us anyway, so yeah. That's power. <laughs> they have it. Yeah. And so the uh, the uh, regular ones without foil aren't gonna be too aren't gonna be too bad with glare. But uh, So what is that for hmm? unblock? <laughs> Here, Commander Legends. This one. This one. With that thing, yeah. So. Then a few hours in the making. We were both at each other's throats. We were going to be very upset at each other, so. We, we were close. We didn't quite get there. Yeah. We have a shirt over the. Uh, the light to diffuse. The glass the, thing to diffuse the light, light so. Maybe next time when we do this, um, we might actually have lamps to diffuse the light. What do you know? We're working on getting a studio going for you. But for now, <laughs> this, is, this is what we have. Okay. okay, so you can open those. Okay. And I will go ahead and open the packs. How to build a deck! <laughs> yeah, you need all the help you can get. Okay, so one for me. One for you. One, two, three, one, two, three. You can have the extra pack and then I'll have them. this box Thank here. You. You're welcome. Yo. So if we get a pirate, I get the pirate, right? Yeah. Sure, I'll yeah. get everything else. Yeah. Including the lands. That Hy Hydras need. and pirates, that's all I care about. Yeah. Okay, so you have the extra pack, so you can go first. Which, just on top? The whatever you want to do. Here we go. Pack number one of what, 36? I think so. Uh, so it's an uncommon. There's Kalana Keswick Ranger. Oh my god, the great. Perfect. The foil, where's the rare? Or was it at the front? There is no rare. Pack. <laughs> You're shitting me. No. I don't buy it. There that's the orange, right? That's what we're looking for? Yeah. There is no orange. rare in this pack. Or, or yellow. Let me see. There is no... Oh, Did yellow? You... Yeah. That one. Oh my goodness. There is no orange. Well, that's fine. If pack. it has this little... If it has... Okay. So it ha Remind it has... me the colors again. Okay. 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 So this is rare. It's okay. yellow. Yes. Mythic is the orange. orange. Silver is the uncommon. Okay. And black we is got, the common. We got two uncommons. Two uncommons. Yes. Okay, that's good. Oh, three uncommons. Three uncommons. That's Four more. uncommons. Four um... Five uncommons. <laughs> the Tog Torgo, the guy with the rock. I guess it doesn't really, the incommons don't really matter. People are going to care about the rare, which I guess I just spoiled it. It was Court of Bounty, which um, I'm hoping for the uh, white wart. I forget what it's called, but that's going to go into Taste Up to get it. Set the uh, tokens. I'm going to attack on Titan. Well, don't kill me. It's like attack on Titan. Kind of thing. Yeah, we can draw little people in there. There we go. Hey, Alright. Alright, so And literally... Okay, okay, actually, I should have listed off the cards that I wanted, because... Let me see, we have the Elfish Dreadlord, which he's not bad, he kind of sucks. But the one commander that I wanted from this set, we just pulled... Oh, nice. Okay. So I pulled this uh, this guy. Um, I want to make this. He's an enchantment dude, but it's in red, white, and black, which doesn't really normally uh -huh. play with enchantments. So you can uh, pay the three. I forget the uh, the guild for it. Tap him, and you get rid of an enchantment. You sacrifice an enchantment that's on the battlefield, and then swap it with one that's in the graveyard. Okay. So if Eldrazi, uh, Eldrazi Conscription, which costs like eight, mana is in the graveyard and you have um soul link which costs one white mana 
and then you swap it. Bloop. Uh, Soul Link gets sacrificed, and Eldrazi Conscription goes on to this giant monster okay. now uh, for free. Oh. oh for, for three. It's not free. It's three. Not that's free. still, that's basically free if you're fully Eldrazi. It's kind of ridiculous. <laughs> yeah. I mean, I don't have to pull any more packs because I got the one. <laughs> okay. Well, we need to search for the one I want, so we got to keep going. <laughs> Um, by the way, Mrs. Coconut is in this video today. Hi! Oh yeah, I guess I should have introduced Yeah, we should have maybe, you know, Did an not... introduction. Yeah, that would have been good. We're like, hi, we're gonna do the thing. We're doing the thing. Yes. Oh yeah, we're us. <laughs> Ghost of Ramirez de Petrio. Oh, Spirit Pirate! He's a pirate! <laughs> cool. I so I'm building a tribal pirates deck just so we're clear. So that's awesome. Why are you being mean? Oh. Oh it is the land. It was the land. Okay. Or room. That whole platform sucks. It? Okay. So what is it called? War Room? War Room. Uh, tap to add. Colorless pay life equal to the number of colors in your commander's color identity. Draw a color. Guys, we have three in my pirate pile. Oh. Nobody cares. <laughs> I care. Well, you have to say you're a maybe. No, you, do, you gotta do your glitter beard thing. Yar! Maybe glitter beard! Perfect. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> so Court of Ire, which is the red court, which is kind of neat. Actually, we got three. Actually, I pulled a triple rare in this one. Okay. Oh, nice. Actually, look at this. So I pulled uh, this uh, Nimrus Ooh, Luna's Trickster. Very nice. Right? And then I pulled this uh, Nimrus oh, no, Luna's Trickster. Tra I feel like that wasn't supposed to be in there. <laughs> that's that's accidental. Somebody put that pack together wrong. <laughs> well, that was a, a good error on our on our thing. What are you doing? I'm looking through the other comments and comments. <laughs> You're funny. I'm a sucker. So what's the land? Undergrowth Stadium. Oh, enters the battlefield tapped unless you have two or more opponents. Oh, so that's the Battleborn. Green and black. Good. I like that. So, <laughs> for those of you who need a token that's a copy of it, we have a copy token now. <laughs> this should be a cat. Yeah. Okay. Isn't it it's a copy cat? We also pulled Moody. We got a lot of decent commanders already. Why didn't you laugh? I'm, I'm laughing on the inside. Bye. So, we just pulled a Moody, the green blue commander option, and we just pulled. Gore Maldrak. The Amphinola. Enf the guy with the lizards. English. Uh, Cascade Naga Dragon. Spells you cast with converters, mana cost. Six Orc Raider have Cascade. You want to show them on the camera? I needed to read it. I can't read you on can the You can read camera. it if you hold it up like this. You're being rude. I'm not. You're being rude you're to them. Being rude. Yes. Yeah. And white, the weakest color, as usual. Slash the ranks destroy all creatures and planeswalkers except for commanders. <laughs> of so, course. including your opponent's commander. Oh. So, it destroys everything except each other's commander, which doesn't make any sense. What? You were going to try and say something. That's really expensive. <laughs> Not getting rid of the most important thing <laughs> in a commander game. I know. Okay. Uh, and the rest of it is garbage. Um, so, I guess that. That double cool. double fairy makes up for this. My turn. Rapture spire. Rapture spire. Rapture spire. Are you sure? Enters. Yeah. No. Apparently not. Uh, Dreamstone <laughs> hedron volcanic torrent. Why are you being mean today? Blade griff prototype. He is flying. Architect. Eh. If you set it on the thing, it won't fall off. Okay. I would have to choose, I think, the player that was attacked. This doesn't make any sense. See, I feel like this is going to get banned so fast. The players whose turn it is, their turn ends. It's not going to get banned, but there's a lot of tricks that can they're, happen with that. It's in red-blue. I already hate it. <laughs> 
Okay. Oh, that was involuntary. That's, that's a control thing. That is a cute one. And then we also got your lock, who has vigilance. Ooh. A player using unspent mana causes that player to lose that much life. Uh, pay one tap, and each player adds black, red, green. Yeah. So it bas it's there's this old mechanic called uh, mana burn, and they got rid of it over time. Because like if you you know your hydra deck, you make a bazillion mana, right? Mm -hmm. And you change turns. In the olden days, you would take that much damage from mana. Mm. That this card brings that back. Uh oh. Yeah, so that's going to be You'll have to warn me against that. <laughs> <laughs> Marble diamond. Nobody cares about your pack of finding pirates over here. You're holding out on me. Uh, what? Keeping your pirates over there, man. What? Oh, God. Okay, so Sakashima's will. Uh, I don't think that's very good. I don't know what it is. I haven't really paid attention. I don't like it. You can play too much blue. That's all. <laughs> uh, choose one if you control a commander. Oh. As you cast a spell, you can choose both. Target opponent chooses a creature they control. You gain control of it. it sounds like permanent. That actually sounds like something you want to do with pirates. For a pirates thing. Yeah. Um, so choose a creature you control. Each other creature you control becomes a copy of that creature until the end of turn. So you steal your opponent's biggest. Hey, look at me. You steal your opponent's biggest creature, and then turn all of your pirates into that creature, and then attack. You want this card? You cannot have this card. There's now 10, 10 cards in my pirate pile. <laughs> this one's really cool. Look at this picture. Ooh, oh, that one freaks me out so bad that Elf Horror <laughs> has like been haunting my dreams since the this set came out. The living mouth said run! Yeah. <laughs> Vigilance. Menace. No, I don't like that. That man gives me nightmares. Abomination of Lanlor. I... I mean, it's a really cool card. The art's <laughs> fantastic. But it's literally black and green elves, and elves are bad yeah. enough as it is. Yeah. So, this, this card disappoints me. <laughs> disappoints you in a like. The art is beautiful. Well, the art is beautiful. I just don't like elves. Like, I think, I feel like elves is like the, the second class slivers, <laughs> and they're kind of like. <laughs> There's a few people I know that you just pissed off by saying that. <laughs> okay. Yeah, no, you're right, though. Sorcery, Lightning Raid Crew again, Explosion of Riches, Shakashima's Protégé, Creature Shapeshifter, with Flash and Cascade. We'll get this. Uh, you may have her enter the battlefield as a copy of any permanent that entered the battlefield this turn. She's ex Expensive, yeah, so you have to have something else that enters and then cast this thing um, to get the uh, cascade effect. But she's expensive because of cascade. Because what she does is you cast her for six. Okay. okay. Cascade triggers, so you look for something else in your in your deck. Uh, that or uh, what does it say? Uh, when you cast a spell, exile cards from the top of your library until you exile a non-land card. Uh, that costs less than six. Oh, okay. And that that uh, enters the battlefield. I know you're gonna be excited for this one, and this one makes me sad because I feel like it's going in Tesa. The Chroma Vision of Ixidor. No. Flying, first strike, vigilance, and trample. At the beginning of each combat until end of turn, each other creature you control gets a one one plus one plus one. If it has flying, plus one plus one. If it has first strike, and so on and so forth. Uh, double strike, death touch. Blah, 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 blah. This would go in the Odric deck that I had put together. Uh, <laughs> no. Yeah, but I mean, it's white, so I mean, yeah. it's not, it's not the. And this one's gorgeous, and I'm like drooling over the fact that it's foil. But we have prophetic prism. Um, it enters the battlefield. You draw a card. You tap and add one man of any color. But I mean, just. Look at this. That's gorgeous. So we actually have a couple of these. We have it as a spoil? Yeah. We do? Yeah. Still. I've never <laughs> seen it. 
<laughs> I'm excited for it. Look at it. It's a rainbow. Shasa Debaser. I actually want it. So, uh, he says when he attacks, click target creature card from defending player's graveyard onto the battlefield under my control. Okay. And um, so when he attacks, right? Mm -hmm. And encore. Encore is a new mechanic. So if we're if we're in a table of four people, I pay his encore cost, and I think I'm exile it because he's dead, right? Mm -hmm. I get three tokens of this guy attacking my opponents, which means I'll get to get three creatures from each of their graveyards. Oh, okay. Yeah, and do you know who likes tokens? Who? In black? Who? Ah. Taysa doesn't like anything. So then I borrow one of your Hydras. No! Swing at your face with it. It has Vigilance and Life Link because of Taysa. My Hydras are mine. Okay, so you we're... saw last time somebody tried to take my Hydra. Ooh. You saw what happened. We then. we have a pretty card, but it's garbage, so... <laughs> oh, it's full art. Yeah. That's kind of sad. Actually, this is... This, look at this. Look at the foiling that they did on this. Look at that. It's oh, gosh, foiling on really the borders. Pretty. Yeah. But I mean, it's it's, an un it's uncommon. It's kind of garbage. But this 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 card looks beautiful. This is their new foiling process. They're using that for a lot of the fancy cards. Let's and it's the there is no curve. That's the entire reason they came up with a new Ooh, fancy. So hopefully, that's pretty good. I hopefully, hope they do that, that with the rest of their foils from now on because it's nice. Well, and yeah, flat. because where's oh here it is oh. yeah. We got these this morning. Yeah, the and, promos. Um, Those Manic promos have the curve. Yep, Mana Confluence. It's very lovely. But we just opened that, so it's not fair. Mm, but still. they purposefully played with the uh, boiling, boiling process. process. I I'm not upset by it. No, it looks really nice. So well, and they like did a really nice mat on the still the background. It looks like they did one layer of foil on the, the back. I think so. Go ahead and open it near you, where it's comfortable. No, it's ASMR for the for the people that don't get to do it. <laughs> okay. Ew. What? <laughs> All right. Try it. No, the. There, through it. All right, we have Howling Golem, Trusty Attack Beat, Chrono Wave Together, Dark Advance, Flying Striper, Palace. Uh, Palace Central, Maelstrom, Colossus, Ancient Information, Revelation, Fire Diamond. <laughs> right, so skirmish, pirate pile, golem artisan, grafted warbringer, patron of the billion, and vampiric <gasps> tutor, your favorite thing. Actually, not my favorite. That's one of the money cards. Oh, okay, cool. I think it's sitting at around 45, something like that. I'm loving the zombie elves in this set. So we got Belby. Uh, she, she is... She's putting a color baby. Hey, baby. Hey, baby. Okay. Bebe is a legendary zombie elf. At the beginning of each player's post-combat main phase, that player adds two colorless for each of your opponents who lost life this turn. Yeah. Baby corrupted observer. And then I have another pirate here. Whoop, whoop. That's, that's going... I don't know where that's going yet. Reshape the earth. Listen to this. Hmm. Search your library for up to 10 land cards. Bleh. Put them onto the battlefield tapped and then shelf your library. But it only costs nine mana. Oh, only nine. Yeah, but it's green, so it's just pretty easy to, you know, pull that. Uh, and then we have Amaranth, the Lustrum, Lust, Lustrous, the Shiny. Amaranth, Amaranth, the Shiny, does not foil. Whenever another permanent enters the battlefield under your control, look at the top card of your library. If it shares a card type with the permanent, you may reveal that card put in. So I guess if it's a land. Okay. Each player sacrifices six creatures. You create six tapped doo doo black zombie creature tokens. That is going in my zombie deck. Each player sacrifices six creatures, which includes yourself. Yeah, but if I have graveyard, that's well, not it. Well, sure, but you just still have to sacrifice. But yeah, seven mana. Um, and then we got uh, Hans Eriksson. Fancy pants. He's weird. He needs to survive being attacked. <laughs> uh, profane transfusion. Uh, this one's cool. Uh, I like the art. 
Yeah. Uh, two target players exchange life totals. Okay. <laughs> okay. You create an XX colorless horror artifact creature token where X is the difference between those players' life totals. Now, what happens when I play Tesa? I gain yeah. a little bit of life, right? Yeah. Okay. So if I have 150 life and you have 15 and we exchange life totals, I give you 115 whatever and I have 15 life now. Right, but now you get 140 something token. Which, because of Tesa, has vigilance and life. <laughs> if you could tie that into a death trigger and get it twice, that'd be stupid. <laughs> yeah, but look at this. This is even better than that. Elise, Reverend Medium, that is the second commander that I wanted. Yes. She is going in Tesa. 100%. Yeah. Okay, so at the beginning of each end step, create X11 white spirit creature tokens with flying. Where X is the number of creature, uh, X is the number of tokens I created this turn. Not just creature tokens, mm -hmm. literally every any token, any token. If I create treasures, I create spirits. If I create clues, I create spirits. If I create tokens, I create spirits. That is going into into Tesa. <laughs> Oh, that one's pretty good. Yeah. And then we got a really cool color for that one. Okay. Token, diamond. Oh, goodness. Oh, goodness. Oh, goodness. Another good pick. Scroll rack. Ah. Uh, actually, I think that one's around 30. Oh, cool. And then Kolfenor, the last you. Not me. You. <laughs> Not a lamb, but a you. And he's a tree. He's a tree man with reach. Yeah. Tree folk shaman. Yeah. And then this this red um, partner. I actually like him. Um, oh, he's cute. He looks like the little salamander from Frozen. <laughs> Whenever a commander you control deals combat damage to an opponent, it deals. Uh, that much damage to each other opponent. So it hits you and it smacks the rest of them. I like him because it's going to be He's adorable. <laughs> I like him. Next pack. Are you Canadons? Or Phoenix. Oh, that one's unfortunately not very good. So, do, 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 do. Uh, Stone Fury, Arrangement, Shaman, Seer, Scholar, Vow, Beast, Laboratory, Drudge. This guy seemed kind of neat. Uh, at the beginning of each end step, draw a card if you cast a spell from a graveyard or activate an ability of the card to graveyard this turn. So, Muldrotha, that was going to be kind of good. Uh, and the rest of these were garbage. Myra of the Thornglade. Myra of the Thornglade, Radiant, Sarah, Archangel, and then a Oil scholar and a rock token. Eek. Eek. Beginning of your instep, sacrifice each other creature you control. <laughs> Discard two cards, sack, play reaver, choose target opponent, return, play reaver, So basically, it's a board wipe on their side. That's kind of silly. What ifs? Spans, prophetic lens, monstrous onslaught, of is perfect, Nev's disc, which is neat. Oh yeah, uh, Nevin roll was the other command I was hoping to get. <gasps> this is the, like one of the three cards in this that I actually wanted. As long as it's your turn, commanders you control have indestructible. Yeah. Not even that good. So oh, fancy wolf. <laughs> Get out of here. Port of Bounty. Two Port of Bounties. That's unfortunate. I was hoping for the white. Yep. Alright, that is it. That is all our 
All our fortune favored. I think you were right about the vampiric tutor once we pulled that. The rest of it was kind of true. <laughs> yeah, but the scroll rack was pretty good. Unfortunately, our nice card was just an uncommon, which is really unfortunate. I'm doing yeah. this, but I'm going to get rid of this here. Um, so yeah, the vampiric tutor. Nothing's going to stay. Um, vampiric tutor was our big money card. The scroll rack was number two. And unfortunately, like I said before, we had one of the nice foils and it's a garbage on top. I got a lot of pirates though. <laughs> but actually, actually, to be fair, where are those? Well, we're, going to, we're going to Big Town too. So maybe. Do some trades. Maybe. Um, Scroll Rock doesn't have me that excited, so maybe get rid of that. But yeah, there we go. That was our pull. Let it let us know what you think. Um, if you know if this is worth it, if you enjoyed it, we'll make a better setup with better lighting and have a better organization of this, and we won't do this in the middle of the night. Yeah. And uh, we'll just go from there. So we're done. Good night.